Here is a common size of balance sheet of company A and B. Question is, which ratio indicate lower liquidity risk for company A compared with company B? Cash ratio, kick ratio, and current ratio are measuring company's liquidity risk to find out company's short-term obligation. Cash ratio is measured by cash asset divided by current liability and kick ratio is measured by kick asset divided by current liability and current ratio is measured by current asset divided by current liability. Cash asset is considered cash and cash equivalent and marketable security. And quick asset is on top of cash asset considered account receivable. And current asset is on top of Quick asset, which include cash, marketable security, and account receivable, also include inventory. So let's plug the numbers and calculate this liquidity ratio for company A and B. For company A, cash asset is cash plus marketable security divided by current liability 35 is 0 0.28 and for company B cash asset is 5 plus 0 divided by 25 becomes 0 0.2 Higher ratio means less risk. So for company A is actually having the lower risk using cash ratio. Let's continue and calculate quick ratio and current ratio. Quick ratio is taking into cash and marketable security and account receivable divided by current liability then it becomes 0 0.42 and for company B quick asset is cash marketable security plus account receivable divided by current liability and it becomes 0 0.8 and for current ratio for company A, it's going to be sum of cash, marketable security, account receivable, and inventory divided by current liability. And it becomes 0 0.85. For company B, current asset is cash plus marketable security plus account receivable plus inventory divided by total li uh, the current liability and it becomes 1.6 so for kick ratio b is higher and for current ratio b is higher